What's going on, Round Trippers? On this episode, we will be exploring the wonderful country of Argentina. As I mentioned in my last two videos, if you are interested in dope adventures like this, I strongly suggest you check out Up in the Air Life. I don't know if I'm pronouncing this right, but we stayed at the Palacio Duha. This property was actually one family's personal mansion back in the day. It's amazing, but it looks even better at nighttime. The property has all marble floors, marble bathrooms, a crazy flower shop, gigantic ballroom, an art gallery, an indoor underground pool, a wine room, and a damn cheese room. Of course I made friends with my girl Miranda, aka the food blogger, and she was nice enough to give me a special cheese room tour. The US dollar stretches so far over here. Make sure to ask if the restaurant you're eating at or the store that you're shopping at honors the blue market. Because it basically means if you use US dollars, everything is half price. That's right, half price. Listen up, I don't care what country you're in. If you see a group of soldiers marching with swords or guns or whatever they have, do not stand in front of them trying to take a selfie. It never ever ends well. They do not discriminate. They don't care if you're old, handicapped, or a kid. They will run your ass over. That evening we had reservations to go to the award-winning restaurant, which I cannot pronounce, but it's known for their 18-course meal.
that's how you do Dinner was phenomenal. Every Saturday, the parks have a flea market. They sell everything you can imagine, and they also participate in the blue market rates. If you're a souvenir person, you can get souvenirs for the whole family for under 20 US dollars. It seemed like all the local businesses participated in the blue market rates, which is such a wonderful thing. So I was curious to see which spot had the best empanadas. That just gave me another reason to eat. Yeah, four beef, four chicken, and one spinach. Ah, one spinach. Yes, please. Oh, I'm sorry. Spinach. Spinach and cheese. Spinach. Delicious. The best empanadas in town. Come see these Hi. people. <laughs> Damn, I wish I could dance like that. Shout out to my Aunt Sherry. She can actually tango really good. Well, this spot was so good that I came back twice trying to be the first person to get here. And somebody beat me to it. Got here right before they open. They are completely booked for reservations. And the grub is going to be delicious as usual. Highly recommend this spot. Fervor.
With the blue market rate, that meal cost me 19 US dollars. Thanks for viewing and make sure you hit the notification bells, guys. Stay safe.